Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. I've been building all my Arduino experiments uh, on this prototyping platform here that came from the original Arduino starter kit. So you've got, the, of course, the Arduino and the 400 point uh, breadboard and then there's this wooden base. But I like to have the uh, ability to wire up a second circuit without having to tear down an experiment that maybe I still want to work on uh, at a later date. So I decided to get this this base plate here, this prototyping base plate. Uh, it's only five dollars from Ada Fruit and another 400 point breadboard with uh, another Arduino Uno. So that that way I can do another experiment without having to constantly tear something down, especially you know, if I, I still want to work on this, uh, this particular case here, it's not that complex. But if you have a lot of wiring and you still want to, you know, work on that circuit, it's a pain having to tear it all down and uh, start all over again at a later date. So I'm going to put together this second prototyping platform so I have that option. So this mounting plate or base is plastic or acrylic. A couple of, uh, I don't know if these are nylon, no, maybe they're metal, and some rubber feet are included. It's just a nice simple platform to mount the two components, uh, the Arduino Uno microcontroller and the breadboard. So they have a little outline etched in the plastic there for the breadboard side and the microcontroller. I guess uh, you have a little option there of how you want to orient this. Let's see, there's some paper on the back here. You just peel this off. Easier said than done. So I'm going to orient it like this. And there's only two screws. So I think. Uh, Put one here and second one here. Okay, so I have the Arduino connected to the mounting plate. And you just peel off, this has the double sided sticky tape on the breadboard. You just peel this off. And press this on. So I've got the breadboard on. The last thing is to put these feet on the back here. In case I ever want to mount this to something else, I'm not going to cover up these holes that are on the corners. So that's finished. So I now have a second platform I can use to build circuits on so I don't have to tear down an existing circuit if I'm still working on it or want to continue with it at a later date. So it's a nice resource to have. That's what it looks like. So if you found this video interesting, please subscribe, like, and or comment. And thanks for watching.